Hello everybody. This week's camera is the Konica Tomato. Uh, it was made from about 1985 until at least 1992. There was a Danish commemorative version of this called the Dynamite. Uh, it's a fixed focus 35 millimeter lens. Uh, focuses from 1.5 meters to infinity. The sweet spot for this lens is about 2.8 meters. It has a fixed shutter, uh, 1 125th of a second. Uh, it takes a single AA battery that powers the light meter and the flash. It works without a battery. You just get no meter and no flash. The only thing the meter uses it for is to power this red LED that tells you you need to use the flash. Um, there's a separate indicator that lets you know that the flash is charged. Uh, it's guide number 10. It's a decent little flash for such a small camera. Uh, there's three ISO settings here on the switch under the lens. Uh, 100, 200, and 400. And that actually changes the aperture. So you get a bit of control over the aperture. You just got to monkey with it here. 100 with the flash is f4. 200 with the flash is f5.6. 100 with the flash off is f8. 200 with the flash off is f11. And 400 with the flash off is f16. Uh, it has this close-up switch, but that's just for using the flash close-up between one and a half and two meters and it stops the aperture down from uh, however it's set. So you can, you know, get quite a bit of control for it not really giving you a lot of control. The lens is sharp, sharp. It's not labeled Hexanon like some of the older Pop series cameras were, but uh, it takes great pictures for a little plastic mid-80s thing. Ran a roll of Fuji 400 through it. Got some good results, so I'll run another roll through it. See you then.